We are just meters from Brazil's border with Venezuela in the town of Pacaraima. This is a small border town with only 12,000 residents, but they have seen hundreds of thousands of Venezuelans pass through in recent years. This has created a strain not only on resources in this rural area, but it's also created a lot of tension between Brazilians and Venezuelans, which has reached a boiling point in recent weeks. How can you treat us so badly? We sleep on the floor. Please, have a heart. Because Brazilians are worth nothing, right? Worth absolutely nothing. We help you, and you're here stealing from us. You're here stealing from us. Here in Brazil, we are helping the Venezuelans, but the majority of them steal from us, breaking into our homes. We can't even go out anymore. He set fire to the Venezuelans' clothes. This guy, with his people, the shopkeepers, they burn the Venezuelans' food and clothes. Did you or didn't you? No, not me, no. We aren't immigrating because we want to. We love Venezuela. There are a lot of Brazilians there because they love Venezuela. I'm a businesswoman. I had a house and a car back home. And look at me here. I'm living like a vagabond. I eat out of rubbish bins. My children and I eat out of rubbish bins. In reaction to the violence and conflict that we've seen here in Pacaraima, the government has prolonged the state of emergency status for another six months, as well as sending these special forces with hopes of preventing any further conflict.